So, it's October 26, which means that yesterday was Cascade Day, which means that I got a new video essay out. My fifth Homestuck video essay, The Trials of Trezzy Pyrope, and there's been overwhelmingly positive reception. I got 60 people uh, watching the premiere, which was incredible. It's up at something like 300, maybe more at this point, views by now. Uh, like, Homestuck fans like my videos. And that's good, because I'm working on another one. Um, it was just great. So far, all the comments have just been like, Hell yeah, this is awesome, I like this. Not a lot that I can really talk about or respond to, which is kind of bad for the series where I respond to comments. But, you know, it's fine. <sighs> and I am so glad that that is over, and now I can start working more seriously on my later video essays. Uh, like, uh, the, uh, next Homestuck essay, which is going to be rewriting the ending of Homestuck, and the thing about that one is that there's so many goddamn comics that tried to rewrite the ending of Homestuck, to the point where, literally, yes, yesterday, the day I released this video that ends with the trailer of me saying, I'm going to be talking about the re fan rewrites of the ending of Homestuck, and here's a list of them. I found, that day, I found another one called Nightfall that I need to read through and add it to the list. It just, it, it keeps growing. Now I'm up at 15. I am up at 15 endings to Homestuck. That's too many. No, no, no. Actually, no, 17 if we count Homestuck and the epilogues, which I do. They're not fan endings. But God, there are so many endings to Homestuck. And the best one's the original ending to Homestuck by a wide margin. Second best would be the epilogues, although they're not really an ending, but they end... It's a good, it's very clearly like the second part of a trilogy, but I think the epilogues have a very good ending with just Dirk, Dirk's horror, horrific treatment of Jake and Kanaya in one ending and then the other one with John and Roxy's conversation and John finally getting over his bullshit. Um, and it's great sub for a sequel, very excited. was hoping we would get a... Uh, Another update to Beyond Canon yesterday because it was Cascade Day. And I've said this before, that comic needs to get its big end of Act 1 uh, animatic. That needs to be completed before 4.13 because, like, I would, I'd like to talk about it. I'd like to uh, talk about uh, it when I talk about Beyond Canon. Be like, hey, you know, Beyond Canon, it's been rough, but it's, it's improved and I loved this Flash animation that just came out. I don't... And honestly, Flash animations, I'm a sucker for them. Homestuck fans are suckers for them. Uh, there... Like, there weren't any bad Flash animations in any of the comics I read as part of this project. But Flash animations are a good way to make a Homestuck comic good. And anyway, now we gotta go fight Lenora. Uh, so my current schedule is I'm going to be completing uh, Empire of Steel. There's five more parts. I'm working on them, and the last two should come out early January. Uh, my Christmas special this year is the third part of my Batman is a fascist videos, this one. All right, that doesn't have the elevator in this game. Or maybe it does, but you don't go down there. Oh, the gym leader is your wife. Good for you, dude. I don't remember this gym puzzle at all, but I'm just going to beat up these trainers. Uh, oh, God, don't you have to hit the bookshelves in the right order? Hold on, hold on. You, attendant, what's the puzzle? Uh, nice to meet you, Pokemon. Sweets for Pokemon. No, fuck that. I don't want candy for Pokemon. I want candy for people. It's what I am. Okay, that's good. This is kind of dumb puzzle. Uh, first Pokemon. Okay, so the puzzle is go... F Wait, hold on. What? Do I have to start the whole thing over again? Problem is, I'm just... Mashing through. Oh, yeah, it's a patch rack because it's a normal gym leader flame burn. Uh, what is this? But it's a train. It's a train. Let me go run the train. 
Okay, and now we get a battle. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm finishing up The Empire of Steel. I'm doing his Batman of Fascist Part 3, which I need to start filming probably next week. Uh, there, I'll talk about that in a sec. And um, in February, I would like to do another viewer choice video. I don't think I'll have time with all the other things I'm working on to do We Are the Wave, so I'm going to push that one back. It's going to be a vote between that time Batman and Superman shot each other with real guns and the scene from Terminator 2 bothers me. Those are what our viewers will be able to vote on for the February viewer choice video. Good. Ooh, this is going to be a tough battle. I hope I don't lose any Pokemon. Okay. Okay, memo on the back. So is she just defacing the books to get this gym puzzle? Uh, in the pot, entrance, sweets for Pokemon, sweets for Pokemon, got that. Um, and then in March I'm gonna do like a four year, uh, thing, like going back, do my videos hold up, some of them don't, and then we get Homestuck 6. Two backward, one to the left, two, two forward, one to the right, one backwards, So two back one. Is that just this? Or is it the other trainer? I don't fucking... I am not paying... There's a fucking fly on my face. Yeah. Um, so anyway, yeah. That's what I'm working on. And um, the other big thing in my life is I have a new apartment. I finally moved out of my parents' basements is great. I love this new apartment. It's nice. Um, although it's up, uh, I counted uh, 30 steps. It is a long staircase up to this apartment. It's a four and a half. It's above a bar, so it has high ceilings. And oh, God, just the day I moved in, 10 trips up and down those stairs, carrying boxes and suitcases. And um, afterwards, I couldn't move my legs. I was in the worst pain. Now, I could go uh, get some uh, painkillers from the store, but that will require going down those stairs again, and worse, up them again. So I just lied there in agony, so bad that I could not sleep, and also I was seriously considering I might have to call off work tomorrow because I am just in so much pain right now because of these steps. And then, and then the next day, I got my furniture moved in, and my brother and his friends helped with that because they're young and strong and not white-collar nerds like me. Um, but the, the problem is, this fucking stupid Protestant work ethic, like, our parents raised us to A, oh, always help uh, people who ask for help and don't, ask, don't expect payment in return. And also, if anyone ever helps you, you have to pay them. It's just being polite. And these two ideals don't work when you're like brothers. Like, those... Those are contradictory ideals, mom. That doesn't work. Um, so I'm just like, take this money. I don't want your money. Take this money. I want to give it to you. Nah, I don't need it. Uh, I solved it by giving them beer. I don't drink, but they do. So I gave them beer, and I guess that's it. That beer was way worth way less than I paid them, but I mean, it's something. Uh, okay, go read the last book, and that'll open the way. And actually... A, I need to go heal, but B, I have a plan for this gym leader because Lenora, her signature move is Retaliate, which I'm pretty sure it's a 70 power normal move that will be used by her uh, Watchdog, which is, or Watchhog, which isn't that strong of a Pokemon, but it'll get a boost um, from Stab and also it's high level from this. And the point is Retaliate doubles power if you just killed the Pokemon. So, um, yeah. Uh, that's going to one-shot something I have, which is bad in a Nuzlocke, so who do I want to sacrifice? Uh, I'm going to flip a coin to see which one I sacrifice, because I don't think it'll be the P-Dove. Um, okay, I don't. Where's my coins? I'm going to do on my phone. Heads, I kill the Panseer. 
Panseer's gonna die. Sorry, Panseer. But you're not a very good Pokemon. <laughs> hey, hey, it's been like, what, six parts in this Nuzlocke? No deaths? This time, we get a death. And here, let me add him to the team roster. So, tell you what, if it can survive, if it doesn't instantly die, I will add it to the team. I will add it to the team if it does not die. But it is going to die. <clears throat> okay. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. And, um, hold on, I gotta get a cough. Yeah, I'm mewing myself so I can cough so it isn't gross into the microphone. Um, and last night, uh, I made a mistake with my apartment where I got locked out. I accidentally locked my keys in my apartment as I left. And I mean, I could I could theoretically go back to my parents' house for the night, but uh, my keys were attached to my keys. I couldn't drive away. And my landlord had left the state that night. So, well, I'm shit out of luck. Fortunately, like, I live above a bar right now, and I just, I'm talking to, like, uh, the bartender, like, oh, oh, she, she's out of town, oh, that's terrible, that kind of fucks me over, and just guy at bars, like, I know how to pick locks. Yeah, you got a credit card you don't mind me destroying? I can get a new credit card, here's my credit card, can you go fix that lock? Sure, sure. And he fixes the lock. And also, he doesn't expect payment because of this stupid fucking Midwest Protestant work ethic bullshit. Uh, and this hurt here is also tough. Like, why do you... Hmm. So retaliate is 25. I think um, I'm going to heal up in case because I'm pretty sure takedown could do uh, more than 34 damage. I'm just... This is a pain in the ass, Jim. Yeah, that could have killed me if I had done that different. Um, I'm just going to keep healing and let uh, Lenora take herself out with takedown. Or she's going to use a super potion and we're back to the fucking start with this bullshit. Um, I got work up, but I don't think that would work. Uh, actually, I think low kick would do more damage. I think it's heavy enough. <gasps> Okay, okay, that's good. Super effective, but now I'm too weak to take out the Watchog, which is a problem. Uh, wake up. Actually, no, I can heal. Oh, that's better. That's better than Rock Smash. Okay, I can heal with the... I can heal with the monkey that I am sacrificing because the patch rat knows cut. Wait, I could have taught I could have taught the monkey. I could have taught the monkey cut. Oh, and then I wouldn't have to kill this pokemon that was named after one of my wonderful viewers using these fresh waters have saved me in both of the gyms so far. That thud was me hitting my head as I saluted. You were a worthy sacrifice, Panseer. You, your death will not be in vain, because I'm going to win this hopeful- Oh shit, Leer? Oh, I might have to sacrifice another Pokemon. You know what, fuck it. You ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? That's... bad. Uh, how's your defense? How's your 32, 28? Uh, you have slightly more HP. I, I'm going to switch to do it. Because the other, the alternative is losing a second Pokemon. I mean, I could have... I genuinely, I could have uh, switched to the... D Stop! Stop doing that! That's very annoying! Ugh, I don't have any fucking status restorers. So, I'm just... I'm using so many potions. It's a good... It's 
good that I bought potions off screen um, between parts. I think I can take another one unless it crits. Famous last words. Ah, oh, this is a fun gym battle. This is a fun gym battle. This is a fun gym battle. Uh, it's always the normal ones that are pain in the ass. Like Whitney and Crunch? Okay. Can I wake up and kill you? Can I wake up and kill you? Can I wake up and kill you? No? Okay, thank you. Please, sir, may I have some more? I've got super potions for days. <laughs> um, the other problem... Uh, but, but yeah, I got into my apartment again, obviously, because that's where I'm filming this. Uh, the other problem is I don't have uh, internet yet. That is a problem that there is currently not internet in my apartment, and uh, the wireless company won't be able to get me in until November 6th. So that's two weeks without internet, and that's fine. I'm also, I can use my phone, and I don't need internet to write. Um, oh shit, I forgot to turn on my schedule. I... I always do that, and I forgot to do it this week. This is my schedule of videos, which I was talking about earlier. I forgot that for once. Thank you for your sacrifice, Pants here. Um, oh, Team Plasma's robbing the... Damn, she run fast. Um, but yeah, I don't have internet, and the problem with that is that I need internet to work on my D&D stories videos, uh, and I have one that just... If I'm going to stick to the schedule and get this uh, and not fall behind, which is important because I want to start a new season uh, next year, um, I need to get one done by the second in a week without internet. So what I'm going to do this afternoon is go to the office, which is fortunately just down the street from my new apartment, which is part of the reason it's great in this new apartment. I'm going to give that fucking skull back, douchebags. Ugh. I'm going to walk to my apartment, or I'm going to walk to my office. Oh, hey, Berg. Thank you for helping. Um, I'm going to go there. I'm going to spend the afternoon working on D&D stories and get it finished. I got, so far I only have like seven more minutes left to edit for uh, the one where the artificer falls into the volcano. Thank you for the dousing machine. Do I have to use this now? I barely remember this game. So Charon's protecting the museum. That's probably why he ends up taking over Lenore's job in the next game, because he, he guarded the museum. And I'm going to bury my pants here, and I'm going to heal up. Good, good, good. Uh, I'm very excited to film videos in this apartment. A, because, like, I can be a bit louder. I mean, I have neighbors, but I don't care about them as much as, like, my parents. Welcome to hell, Pansier. You were our first Pokemon to go to hell, Lim, and she, 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 uh, But also, I have room to build out a real set that I'm putting together. Uh, turns out you need a screwdriver to put together a bookshelf. I forgot to buy a screwdriver, so I gotta grab that today. I'm gonna have a bookshelf and I'm gonna populate it with like items uh, representing all of my videos and all the things I've done essays on. It's gonna be nice. And where'd that fucking Team Plasma go? I don't know, I'm gonna go into Pinwheel Forest. Cause that's next in the docket, I think, if I remember correctly. Into Pinwheel Forest. This way they might be in trouble. And if I go into Pinwheel Forest, I can catch a new Pokemon, new party members named after commenters on my Terezi video, which not, I don't have a good, like, uh, do you know, like, hypnosis or anything? No. I'm going to use you anyway just to weaken the wild Pokemon so I can catch one of them. Uh, and I know that technically they already got Pinwheel Forest. Oh, you're making me take the long path. Okay. Yeah, Lazy Asperg, making me take the long paths. I know I technically got Exterior Pinwheel Forest, but I'm counting it as separate encounters because it is separate encounters. It's two different areas. Okay, and you may have noticed this video came out early, and you may be wondering, wait, if I don't have internet, then how, how am I watching this? How did you get a video out if you can't upload videos because you don't have videos? I uploaded this at the office, which is why it's actually coming out before midnight because my videos normally come out at midnight because... 
I mean, that's I record them late on Saturday, but I don't want to record this at the office, which is why. Okay, let's take you down. Ooh, you're tougher than you look. I thought that would have one-shotted. I need to teach retaliate to my herd ear. Or, ooh, razor leaf. That's a problem. Never mind. Your stats are too weak. Um, like uh, retaliate would be well. Actually, it's the cool thing. Like you kill my friend, and now I avenge by one-shotting you. But also, it's seventy power, which is decent. And doesn't have uh, the recoil of takedown, which can be useful in drawn out battles. Maybe I'll teach it down now. Uh, next time I'm going to go arrive in Castellia, which is, oh boy, that city is a nightmare to go through. Just so many things. I think I'm going to, I think what I'm going to do is like write out um, a list of, or just look at the Bulbapedia, like which places have things and which places to skip and just go down that list and then fight Berg and then go into the desert. Um, actually, let's not give up on Fury Cutter. I think that has like decent power in this game, right? Didn't they buff it? Oh, that's terrible. That's god awful. Who would ever use Fury Cutter? Okay, um, what else is going on? Um, I was reading two Discworld books, uh, one in my bedroom and uh, one at work during my lunch break, and I finished both of them. Thud is a great book, and Hatful of Sky is a good book, and I don't have much Discworld back. Discw di I don't have much Discworld left. I'm almost through the series. I only have a few left, and I'm going to have to find another book series to hyperfixate on. Can Suwaddle get in the netball? Good, good. It got in the netball. It got in the netball. And I can't um, show the comment because I don't have internet. But C Crystal sixty one eighty nine says on my Terezi video, the doomed Yuri is real. And yep, that Yuri, it was doomed. It was so doomed. And hold on, let me change that pants here to the right Pokemon. That Yuri was doomed. But then it got undoomed, and I mean, they're going to get erased from existence. Like, I don't think that version of Brisker or Terezi is still around anymore. I'm pretty sure they got erased from existence as reality was vaporized. But they were together in the end, and it was nice and sad, and I showed it in my video. And what a wonderful end to such a wonderful character, except about the other Trezzy. The other Trezzy gets to go into the epilogues. And you know, like watching that live chat, there was just like one person who's like, uh, when I talk about Frisk of getting killed, uh, they say the retcon was the worst decision in all of Homestuck. And later, uh, as I say, time to talk about the epilogues. Just like, no, not the epilogues. And like, ooh, I screenshot that. And I'm going to talk about it in the video. Your perfect encapsulation of the attitudes that led to the creation of so many Homestuck fan endings, which is what the video is about. Okay, let's see. Um, how many more plasma grunts do I have to beat up before I can end this? Or maybe I should just end this in the middle, I don't know. I can finally uh, give my duot a name after I accidentally mashed through that last time. That'll be nice. What's in here? Um, I don't think that's the right way to go to fight Team Plasma. I don't know the layout of this game at all, because, like, as I've said before, I have not played this game much at all. Um, there's the Mossy Rock if you want to evolve your Eevee. Oh, where do I get Eevee? You don't. You don't. It was smart in later games for them to just finally make it. Fuck it, it's a Leaf Stone. Um, yes, yes, this... Uh, kind of contradicts how the other games, but screw it. It, it is just a fucking leaf stone now, man. Okay. Good, good. I can't take another hit from that. I'm going to switch to do it. All of my Pokemon are at a kind of precarious level right now. They, I need... Well, I don't want to over-level and make the game trivial, but these ones are kind of weak. Or maybe it's just that Herdier hits like a truck. I don't know. Okay. And then we raise your shell, and I think after this I'm gonna 
run back to heel and that'll be the end of this video next time i fight boy with hat his main personality trait is having a hat you tried to kill my pokemon but you gave me a chesto berry so i guess we're square random pokemon ranger dude you should get a spin-off game yay